in this given problem h is a subset of group g and a belongs to h and b belongs to h these a and b are arbitrary element then their closure a dot b a dot b a dot b means there is an operation either denoted by dot or a star after applying operation on a and b belongs to the set this property is known as closure property so a subset h a subset h of g and uh, h must be non empty a subset h of g said to be group sorry subgroup if by two step test by two step test two step test this is if a b belongs to h then a b belongs to h this is this property sometimes we say closure property and if a belongs to h then their inverse also belongs to h and uh, this property is known as closure property so this is subgroup test or sometimes uh, you can say this is a theorem to prove h is a subgroup of g if and only if this is two step test and you can prove sometimes by one step test which says if ab belongs to h then ab inverse belongs to h this is one step test and sometimes it is very important to play or prove a problem in short time so you can apply these two test on uh, infinite or finite whatever the set but uh, when h is finite then we say uh, there is another test we say finite subgroup test and in this if a b belongs to h then a b belongs to h this is only closure property so closure property is sufficient to prove h is a subgroup if h is finite now according to this problem closure property is given to you and another property given in option d which uh, which uh, which helps you to prove inverse so right one is d